Chapter 1169 Mayachal was really angry. He jumped and scolded angrily, Elaine, you BTCH, are you looking for death? When Elaine heard this, she smiled and said, Big brother, don't you be angry. I spent hundreds of dollars on this pile of green hats, but they are all for you. After that, Elaine didn't know where she took out a green Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles doll, and said loudly, Brother, look at this Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle, he doesn't look like you. Not only has his head green, but he is also very bearable. It's the best portrayal of you, big brother, ha ha ha. Mayachel was almost mad, trembling all over, and even his voice became trembling, you BTCH, why don't you die? You are so wicked that you are going to hell. Elaine chuckled, Big brother, I kindly gave you so many hats. You even cursed me to go to hell. You are too kind to avenge me. But I have always been adults not remembering villains. These are more than thirty. All the green hats are given to you so that you can wear them for thirty consecutive days without repetition. Mayachel was really helpless, so he gritted his teeth and said, Okay you Elaine, wait for me. I will call the property management right now to report you. After finishing talking, Mayachel immediately called the property management of Beacon Top and blurted out, I am the owner of A06. I now complain that the owner of A07 hangs uncivilized things on the terrace of the house. You can take care of it. After a short while, an electric car from the property drove over quickly. Afterwards, Three property managers got out of the electric car and asked, Did you call the complaint? Mayachel blurted out, Yes, it's me, complaining to the woman upstairs, Look at what she has hung up on the terrace. Elaine said coldly, How come my own hat is hung on the terrace, can you still manage it? The three property managers also said helplessly after reading it, This gentleman, the owner's terrace is the owner's private domain. In theory, no matter what it hangs on, we can't interfere with it unless it's illegal. But others. It's not illegal to put on a hat, it's people's freedom. Because of your mother, Mayachel whirled around dryly. If these 30 green hats were hung here all day long, wouldn't he be mad at Elaine? Property managers were scolded by him, naturally they were very dissatisfied, but they still said politely, Excuse me, gentlemen, this matter is not in the management of our property. After that, they got into the battery car and drove away. Elaine laughed more wildly on the terrace, Ha ha ha, Mayachel, now you can't help it, let me tell you, my green hats will always be hanging here, and I will buy another thirty of them tomorrow. Here, I let you open your eyes every day and you can see a lot of green hats fluttering in the wind, fluttering with the wind. You, 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 Mayachel was so angry that he almost vomited blood. At this time, Akex and Emma also went to the terrace on the second floor and took a look. After they figured out what was going on, they both looked at each other helplessly and sighed. Emma couldn't help sighing, Akex, you said it's not good for mom to do this. Akex smiled indifferently, and said, in fact, there is nothing good or bad. Didn't they treat us too much before? When they knew what problem we encountered, they also desperately mocked us. You forgot that at the Beacon Top Sales office, how did the family laugh at us? And when your studio opened, didn't they come to mock us too?